Hey guys, so I just wanted to come clean about my true eye color. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. I found these left over from a video that I never filmed. It was gonna be like a contact lens video. Anyway, it was boring. So I was just gonna wear it for this video, but it hurts so much. I need to take them out right now. I feel like I've got literal lava daggers stabbing into my eyes. This was a failed experiment. 12 seconds later. <sighs> my eyes can breathe. Today, we're gonna tickle some more of my pickle. We're doing some more, <laughs> why? We're doing some more Animal Crossing. I've had some exciting news on the grapevine. What's a grapevine? How can you listen through the vine of a grape? Whatever, the vine went in my ear and I heard that you can catch better fish in Animal Crossing now, which is exciting for me because I'm sure you already know, I have a better fish. I was gonna film this yesterday, but apparently you can only catch it between like 11 a.m. and 4 p.m. So it's currently 2 p.m. So we've got two hours to try and catch the better fish. Let's go. Oh my God, my hair grew. <laughs> Is that how long it's been? <laughs> Phil was truly in quarantine. He's back with the spiffy quiff. Is that a sign that I was away for too long? All right, let's do a tour of my house. First of all, I've got my creepy gnome, Jeff who can scare burglars away. I don't want to brag about my flower garden, but it's the best thing I've ever seen. Interflora is quaking. I've got, <laughs> I've got chrysanthemums, I've got tulips, I've got these things. And then here I've got a hybrid pink flower, which you get from crossbreeding two other flowers, diagonally or something. I don't know, I did it, I'm proud of it. And for all you pear haters out there, I know there's a lot of you. I've now got cherry trees, so you can shut up. And I've got my two palm trees down here little tropical moment. I am rocking this galaxy jacket and purple shorts combo. Phil from 2013 would be proud. I've also got these Elton John style glasses for when Phil <laughs> hits the clubs. And then come into my abode. The first present an animal gave me was a urinal. So now I can <laughs> pee in the corner of my room. I mean, you need a bathroom. I was saying, so you just pee outside. I've got some terrifying Darth Vader looking washer dryer here. An Apple TV my friend Bryony gave me. What's on the TV? Joe Exotic. Apple should take note. If TVs actually look like this, I think everyone would buy an Apple TV. This houseplant is Feng Shui up the wazoo. I love that so much. I think that might be my favorite piece in the whole house. A Newton's Cradle, just because I couldn't resist. Then, freaking me out a lot, but also incredible, I've got a hamster. What is this if this freaking hamster's walking around in jeans? I don't get it, but it's cute. And it reminds me of my younger years of being a hamster breeder. Weird gears on the wall. I don't know what that's powering. I don't know what it's for but I don't want to take it off the wall now in case the whole island collapses like a lost scenario. My bed is a big gay hammock, which I wish I had in real life. Don't know why I randomly <laughs> hung a spotty t-shirt on the wall. Just because you can, doesn't mean you should. Not a fan of the walls. I haven't had a good wallpaper option yet, so we're gonna decorate a bit. So that's my house so far. I hope you like it. Progress is being made. Also, I got about 20 comments saying, Phil, you need to weed. If I see one more weed, I'm gonna unsubscribe. So there you go. You can eat your dinner off my lawn. I hope you're <laughs> happy. What the F is that? Hello, is it a frog? Is that not an animal? Oh, maybe it's a net. A net, get inside my net. Ooh, what are you? Yas, I caught a diving beetle. Now I'm making a splash. Also, if you look at the map in the corner, I now have five residents on my island. Yo, Hazel, speak of the devil. Ah, let's do laughter. You ready? Oh my God. <laughs> That's what laughing from the gut looks like. Really clears the head, give it a whirl. All right, let's test it out. Okay, that was a bit less terrifying than Hazel's. Sorry, Hazel, you only mean well. But what I was saying is I have new residents. I've now got five islanders. Last one we met was Posh Ronda, the rhino. So let's see who else we can find. Egbert. He's a chicken who <laughs> always looks a bit anxious. <laughs> he's got the weight of the world on his shoulders. I don't know what he's manically hammering. Do we want to ask? Do we want to leave? Is it like a horror movie where we just walked in on something and then he's like, you can't leave now, Phil. Hey, it's Phil. I haven't seen you in a long time. I'm still the same old me. I know, for sure, because I wrote my name in all of my underwear. Good to know that you're writing in your underwear, Egbert. Um, watch your step, okay? What are you doing? Not murdering people. I'm making a bone door plate? <laughs> what the hell? He's cut up one of the other animals and he's making a door plate out of their bones. One of the bugs on the floor whispered the DIY instructions into my ear while I was sleeping last night. What does that mean? So I gotta build it before I forget what it even is. I think we should just back away slowly because Egbert is freaking terrifying. Check it out, plans for a bone door plate. I, what, do I want a bone door plate? I don't want to say no to you. <laughs> Those clothes are so spiffy, you look like a fancy cake or restaurant's gonna keep in a tall glass case. Don't put me in a glass case, Egbert. But you got some fancy ass juice like you see in a hotel, so it's not all bad. I mean, there's no cup, so I'm just pouring it all over the floor. But you mean well, 
Don't want to look in your oven. Bye. He's cute. A little serial killer energy hurt no one. <sighs> Alright, where are my other dragons? Um, what the frick am I doing? I need to be catching this fish. I'm so easily distracted. Wait, okay. I heard it's in a river. Does this count as a river? Yeah. And we need to look for a tiny little fish. I haven't seen any fish. Maybe egg would cut them all up. Let's go further downstream. Maybe he's in the sun. Nope. Why is there so many freaky beetles on the water now? All right, I want everyone to close their eyes and send better fish vibes into my river. If you don't do it, I'm not your friend. Oh, did you do it? Because here we have a fish. I think it might be too big though. Yerp. Nah, what are you? Get out of my face. Ooh, close. A bluegill. Well, at least it's blue. We've made some progress. No, get out of my life. This has got to be it. Come on, come on. Loach. More like noach. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I thought it was a better fish. A pale chub. More like pale snob. Oh my God, it's been like 45 minutes. Just give me my Norman. If I see one more loach, I'm going to throw myself in the river. No! How many pale chubs are in this river? Are you trying to murder me? We've got 25 minutes before 4 p.m. I'm starting to sweat. Phil's arm is aching. Let's just find this fish. No! Come on, please, please, come on, come on. Are you kidding? <laughs> You're having an actual laugh. We've got 14 minutes left and I'm catching rocks now. Please. No. 10 minutes, guys. <laughs> I don't think it's happening. I'm giving up hope. I don't even think it's real. I think they're all... What is that? There's a freaking great white shark. There's no better fish. F you, loach. This is it. This is not it. <laughs> <laughs> One minute to go. Oh my god. Right. Come on. Tiny fish. Norman. If you're out there, now's the time. Can you hear me through the Nintendo waves? This one. Come on. Come on. <gasps> no! I thought it was a better fish. It looks exactly the same as Norman. Why would you do this? What? <laughs> How? How could it be so cruel? I'm gonna eat my own tongue. Can we just pretend that's a better fish? It's over. It's <laughs> two hours. Two hours of my life. I didn't even scare any fish away. This is Sparta. I can't believe it. I actually can't believe it. I feel sick. I feel sad. My island is now covered in trash because <laughs> I hooked so much trash. The moral of the story is you can't have everything you want. Better fish are really hard to catch in Animal Crossing. Okay, it's fine. It's not fine. It's fine. It's really not. I, I... We had fun along the way, didn't we? I feel like it was more rare that I didn't encounter one after all that time. Right, I'm gonna sell all these fishies. I hate you all. Get in the bin. Never want to see you again. Ooh, 4,000 bells. Not bad. Oh, I am quite fond of this flamingo. Mr. Flamingo. Yes, I would like that. Thank you. I really want some new wallpaper. Give me that sexy wall. Oh great, the same wall I've already got. Rammed earth? Is that meant to let you cut through some soil and these are all the time periods of earth? I kind of like it more than the yellow. Let's see what it looks like. Ooh, I like this green paint floor. Yes. All your other items are trash, so I'm off. Present. What is this? Ooh, a glass holder with candle. That's cute. My other new resident is this pig violently attacking Lyman with a stick. Look at those death eyes. You have a different vibe about you. Have you been having adventures without me? Sorry, I went to play Final Fantasy. I left you in the dust. Well, whatever. Welcome back. And no more disappearing on me, Kay. They make me feel so guilty. I want to catch a bug off a tree stump because I signed up to a weird challenge, but I can't do it, so I don't know. Can you catch me a bug found on a stump? Yeah, I can. No problem. Um, Sorry, there's no bugs on this stump. Truffles. 
You're gonna have to deal with that. Rhonda, I've been wondering when I'd run into you again since I moved here. I might never have done that if you hadn't made me feel so welcome on your island, Bigfoot. Oh, I love you, Rhonda. Make rhino babies with me. Your home is so cozy. There's a lot of appeal in smaller spaces. Shade. <laughs> Less to clean. Motivation and to avoid clutter. Pretty clever if you ask me. Well, Rondi, I'm gonna put some more stuff in my garden now. I'm gonna put Mr. Flamingo here. Yes, perfect. Let's see how this flooring looks. That's cool. Oh, I love this. Let's try this rammed earth. Ooh, that actually looks pretty sweet. It's like a beach house. What about this one? That looks a bit like a disco toilet. I'm not a fan of that. And I'll put my candle here. Though that might be quite dangerous if I get out of bed and then set my feet on fire. It's worth the risk for the aesthetic. I got mail. Ooh, a present from my mum. My dear Phil, the smell of trees and freshly cut grass. This isn't my real mum, by the way. <laughs> this is the game mum. And a present from the Bank of Nook because they've reduced interest rates. Oh, Happy Home Academy. Rank A. I'm, it's like Christmas, this. I've got mum's knapsack. That is very frilly and whimsical. Thanks, mum. Um... Uh, <laughs> And then we've got a ball, I thought that said a ball bag rug, a bell bag rug. And also a world map. I need a rug actually, let's get this bell bag on the floor. That is horrible. That's like a Scrooge McDuck rug. No, let's put the world map on the wall though. Ooh, apparently Animal Crossing takes place on this actual earth. Lord dump. So what did the Happy Home Academy give me? A double sofa? Do I have space for that? <gasps> Amazing. That has improved the room so much. Lyman just sat in my garden eating a donut. Did you get to hang out with your buddy Dan the other day, Chips? Yeah, I went to Dan's Island. Wow. Kayaking all the way from Denando's. <laughs> That's what, <laughs> that is what Dan called his island. The Isle of Denando's. I've got so many nook miles. What could I get? Brick well, simple well. My own little onsen. I love that. I kind of want the outdoor bath. No. I mean, I have to own this. Yes. Redeem. Oh, it's a little Japanese drink vending machine. With the little hot coffees. I totally want that. And then all my animals can have warm coffee as they walk around. A phone box. How British. Although it's not red. Also, you don't want to go into one of the British ones because they're filled with weird sex things. Wait. No. Wait. I could have had a Godzilla statue, but I bought a recipe for a robot. I was too- Oh, I'm so spontaneous. I need to just see all the options first. It's fine. Give me thousands of Nook Miles. Let's craft an Evangelion. Okay, I need a rocket, just casually. How do you get a rocket? Gold armor. Right, I guess this is the end game thing. At least I've got it in my inventory so I can slowly save up over the years. I'm regretting not getting Godzilla now. Rhonda, give me 5,000 Nook Miles. I'm trying to catch a stump bug for truffles. Yeah, <gasps> there we go. Stealth mode activate. Oh, putting this tree here was a mistake because now I can't see where the stump is. No! I am so unlucky with everything today. Later. <gasps> right, okay. Lyman, don't make me mess it up. Sneak mode activated. Now. Yes! Citrus longhorn beetle. Orange, you happy for me? <laughs> nice, right. Oi, you better give me a golden pig. Let me give you something to say thank you. An outfit. I'm gonna wear it, whatever it is. A track jacket. Oh, that's cool. I like that. I mean, I'm not sporty in real life, but Phil in Animal Crossing, he might love a good squat. Uh, <laughs> I need to clean this trash away. It's very embarrassing. I also got some fences, so I thought I could make my garden zone. Stay off my land. Let's have a look at the museum now. Oh look, it's the fake Norman. Traitor, embarrassing tank number one. These fishes are obviously plotting something. They're all facing in the same direction. I think this is the biggest fish I've got. I'm very proud of my tuna. Bow down to the tune. And I have the most important fossil. I mean, I'm not a scientist, but that is 100% the Yodel and Pickle. Oh, I've got some more Nook Miles. Maybe we're gonna do some more shopping. If I get another 100 miles, I can have the Godzilla. Capture a memory, sure, whatever. Let's do it. Let's get a sexy filter and joy, because I'm in the flowers. There we go. Oh, cute. Immediately purchasing Godzilla. Yes. Oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> It'll be mailed to my home. What's up, mate? We want to have the incredibly popular musician K.K. Slider come and put on a show here at Pickle. Yes, I know who K.K. Slider is. He came to me in a dream. Sexy beast. Okay, so we need to add a campsite. Craft that and pick a great spot on the island for our new campsite. I'm counting on you. Isabel. 
Are you my friend or not? I haven't actually interacted with Isabel yet. What can we do? Change the island tune. Change the island flag. Shall I, <laughs> I should just do that as the island flag. <laughs> it's perfect in every way. Oh no, it does capture the essence of Pickle. Sorry, there seems to be an army of children outside my window. <laughs> no, I can't have that as the flag. We need to go back to square one. All right, we're gonna have a blue background. Then I'm gonna attempt to draw a pickle because, you know, we need to remember what our roots are. Here we go, just gonna let it flow. Oh, I've gone a bit deep there. No, I think it's good, I think it's good. I think it's good. <laughs> Ooh, I think the darker green's better. This is looking incredible. I mean, I, 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 uh, I, I feel like I've surpassed myself. And then maybe a heart, maybe a small one here and here. That's beautiful. Right, Isabel, you're about to have your socks immolated because that is a million times better than my last one. Yeah, I want to submit a new flag, mate. Okay, let's have a look at the flag. Wow. I mean, I don't think that could have gone better. That has redeemed all my sadness from the better fish hunt. Oh yeah, I forgot. I've also got a clothes shop construction kit for Mabel. I think I should put it here because it's the perfect place. This is the spot. Woo. All right, let's see how hard it is to make a campsite. Woof, I need to do some crafting. Okay, I'll do that next time. That's fine. All right, that's enough excitement for today, Philly. Let's put you into bed. Exciting times though. I've got the Godzilla statue on the way. I've got the ingredients for the ultimate robot, which I'm probably never going to be able to make. I hope you've enjoyed that. If you are a YouTube premium member, by the way, you can get one month of free membership to my channel. So if you click the link below, you can go claim it and then you'll get a little cactus next to your name in the comments. So thanks if you do that. And also thank you for coming on this failed better adventure. We tried our best. We didn't succeed. Other Coldplay lyrics. And I hope you're having a good day and I'll see y'all later. <laughs> Bye.